Ricardo, salve. Uh, hello, hello, Ricardo. Hello to all the members of uh, Orbiter Forum uh, Italia. Thank you for uh, your questions uh, th there. So you're you're asking about uh, there's a three dimension situation that we have here in space. Uh, uh, if how long it takes to get used to it, uh, if we get disoriented, and uh, and how how we get used to it. Um, I would say that this is a very interesting situation. As soon as we get uh, up here in space, actually, things start getting a little bit uh, funny. I mean, different than normal, and and uh, uh, the body actually perceives this kind of uh, uh, differences. And and sometimes, uh, especially at the beginning, it does not react uh, very well. You get a little bit nosy in it. You really have to take things uh, careful. But then after a while, you understand that there is no more up and down, uh, that, uh, that, that you force yourself sometimes to work in certain positions that are very inconvenient because you think in terms of gravity. So if you would need to work on the ceiling, for example, I would uh, normally just raise my hand and work like that, but this is very inconvenient. So after a while in space, you just, uh, just realize that, uh, hey, if I put myself like this, Everything is normal. I can just open up, get whatever I need, take it, use it, and uh, and put it back without any problem. So I can easily work uh, in this position, and I feel exactly the same like if I would work in the other position. It takes, I would say that before you get completely familiar with this, it takes uh, about a month or, or, or something like that. I mean. Uh, and after a month, you really uh, uh, see or find yourself uh, doing this kind of things without uh, without thinking too much, without forcing yourself, because it becomes uh, normal and uh, natural. So you can go like this and feeling feel absolutely nothing, because this is uh, what uh, what happens here in space. Uh, did we get uh, disoriented? Oh yes, uh, sometimes uh, we do. Sometimes we don't. Uh, I, I lose I lose track. I mean, I move around so much that I don't realize anymore where I am. Also, because here on the station, there is no real ceiling and uh, and uh, deck, uh, because we tend to put uh, equipment, uh, experiments, uh, hardware in every position. So sometimes you really assume a certain position, make it your up and down, and then when you look back and you see other people uh, coming in in different directions, you think they. They look funny, but in fact they are not. So, bottom line, in, uh, being in space, it's uh, it's really interesting. Uh, having this uh, three dimension to work with, it's very very interesting. It's a little bit challenging at the beginning, but there are definitely a lot of advantages. And I would uh, wish that everybody, all of you, would uh, try it and feel it and experience it. Experience it. It's a very good experience. So. Ricardo, thank you again for your questions. Hello, everybody, to everybody there at Orbiter Forum uh, Italia. Uh, looking forward to talk to you again, to show you some pictures from the Cupola. We will do it uh, another moment. Ciao and take care. Ciao.